Hi friends, welcome once again. In this session, we are going to discuss regarding last, previous, remove, and add selection commands. Now, uh, I have to draw some geometrical entities here. So, I'm going to draw some circles. You can draw any other uh, geometrical entity as per your requirement. I'm going to draw some circles here. Um, so, I'd like to select some particular thing. So, the last geometrical entity is this geometrical entity. I would like to uh, separate this. I would like to change the properties of this particular thing to distinguish from the other entities. So, this is in a green color. Now, I want this to be selected, the last drawn entity to be selected. So, I'm going to select invoke the command move. Then, now uh, I want AutoCAD to select the last drawn command. So, for that, you can use the command last. Last, you can observe here the circle got temporarily changed to dashed lines. That means the circle has been selected. The last run entity has been selected. So now uh, complete the selection process. Select the uh, base point and then select the next point. Now I would like to select this particular circle and then perform move operation. I am moving it in this fashion. Change the properties of this particular thing to something like uh, red color or yellow for identification purpose. So I am changing it to yellow color for identification purpose. So the previously moved entity is this entity. S I would like to perform a move operation once again, but I want AutoCAD to select the previously selected entity. So no need to select all these entities once again, just press P button, then press enter button. You can see here the previously selected entity got selected automatically. Uh, this got changed to dashed lines. That means the circle has been selected. The previously selected entity was circle. That's the reason the select uh, the circle was selected for uh, movement. So coming to the other two options, they are add and remove. Uh, first, we'll concentrate on add. Then invoke move command. Then it will ask for the selection of the geometrical entities. I have selected two entities. If you want to add some more entities, you can use add and then add other geometrical entities or continue the, continue the process. Now I uh, want to remove this particular circle from selection. So you can use one more thing that is remove. You can observe here this particular circle has been removed. So these two circles are only selected. I will repeat it once again. You want to perform move operation, select first circle, select second circle and you, have, you are selecting third circle also. And then now you don't want these three. So you want to remove this particular circle, invoke a remove command, then select this particular circle. Now this circle has been uh, eliminated it is left out from selection so that's all for today thank you friends keep watching subscribe to my videos thank you